What is up everybody, it's your buddy Zero, and today I'm going to be giving you a simple and quick tutorial how to use World Edit to create some pretty interesting decorations. Now, uh, Corrales is one of my favorite YouTubers, he does some incredible builds, and he's doing this series called the Inspiration Series, where he takes and goes around his server with another YouTuber, Shiftmaster, he's also cool, their channels will both be linked in the description, and... What they do is they go around his server, the world of Corrales. I'll put the IP in the description for you, too. And they show off these pretty cool builds. Now, a lot of these builds feature some pretty interesting things that can only be done with World Edit. Or Voxel Sniper, either one. World Edit's the most preferred method, though. And what usually what they feature are some uncommon things, such as upside-down sugar cane hanging from the ceiling lamps made from cactus faces. That's one of the coolest things I've ever seen. And another one, which is uh, tables, chairs, television station? Uh, television, what do you call them? Home entertainment systems? Uh, uh, it's those things that hold up the TV. Uh, like a, sort of like a stand, I guess, in, in Wall Street anyway. Using snow blocks, and it makes a very thin appearance. And I thought I'd teach you how to do that. Okay. The first thing you want to do, you have to be on a server with World Edit enabled. Now, if you don't know how to get this done, I have a tutorial on my channel here that you can uh, look at. And it'll tell you how to set up your server with World Edit and other things so you can get a head start on that. If you don't know how to, go ahead and watch that and learn what I'm doing before we get into this. Anyway, you're going to want to do forward slash forward slash wand and get your world edit wand. That'll let you uh, do world edit. Next thing you're going to do is put yourself in fast mode. Now what fast mode does is it pretty much tells the server, it doesn't tell the server that you're doing anything. That way you don't accidentally mess up because let's see, let me give you an example here. Let's get some glass. Oop. Well, that's going to be a problem. Uh glass pane and some snow blocks now let's go ahead and place a few of these down now if you place it you, can, you can't place a snow block here but I'll world edit one in real quick now if you try to place another one here to make a cool table it won't work even if you try to world edit it in such as this method it still won't work because your block update detection tells the snow that another one's been placed here and it'll delete because it's not even supposed to be there. But if you put yourself in fast mode by doing forward slash, forward slash, fast, it quits telling the server that you're even here. It's sort of. It's complicated, more complicated than that. I'm going to try to simplify this and I'm not doing a good job. But you can read. It says fast mode enabled. Lighting in the affected chunks may be wrong and or you may need to rejoin to see changes. So basically you're not getting updates and you're not sending the server updates. Except in mass. Which is hard to explain. Just take my word for it. Now, if we do the same command, set 78, we can place these snow blocks. And create some pretty interesting patterns. But be careful because if you do place anything, they'll break. So if you do this, don't touch it. Okay, let's start off with a simple little table. Let's see. We'll place once. Well, we want snow. Otherwise, it'll look kind of weird. Um, so let's place one here. We'll have a small table. So let's see. One here. One here. And one here. Now we can go ahead and physically place the snow here. And there's no... The server won't stop us from it. But if we place one here. One here one here and one here. Or you can just place one here and one here, it doesn't matter. Now, if you do set 78, it creates a nice table with very thin table walls. You can't normally do this in Minecraft. It's, it creates some very neat effects. Get rid of that, and you get an even cooler design. I love this. In fact, we can shorten this see here and place that there and see it breaks if you 
place it within a block, so we'll have to do it again. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and do walls, because it'll stop filling in that middle. And it's pretty darn cool. Now, uh, you can also use uh, the expand and contract commands. Expand it one left, expand it one down, and we'll contract it one left. Oops. And one down. So that we've got this space selected. Excuse me one moment. Sorry, I had to cough. And we can put anything we want in here now without doing it physically, like glowstone. Or glass. Or a sapling. Oak sapling. Oak. Huh. There we go. I guess I'd have to use a data value for the different ones, huh? Yeah. Okay. Anyway. Get some pretty neat decoration things out of this. And another one you can do. Let's put a TV over here. That'd be pretty cool. Let's grab some black wool. Have an ultra widescreen TV. Let's place some snow on the sides. Snow on top. Do the set 78. Yeah, that's pretty darn cool. And another, and let's see here now. Place. Well, there we go. Go right here and do set 78 again. Then you get this wicked awesome TV cabinet. You can add buttons. Yeah. To it. And using this, you can, since you're in fast mode, you can even set buttons if you wanted to. So let's do that. That should be neat. Let's see what happens. Yeah. But, uh. And there's our big old widescreen TV with an awesome cabinet. Now, let's go ahead and do an interesting feature here. Let me grab some water. Not a water bottle. That'd take forever to fill up. And let's grab ourselves some double slabs. Here go one, two, three, four, five, six by three. And fill this in here. Grab a gravel. Maybe some uh, glowstone. Brighten it up a little bit. There we go. Place our water. And now up here, let's mirror this. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oops. Two, three, four, five, six. And let's grab my thingamajig. There it is. One. What the heck? Okay. I forgot. You gotta have a 64 stack of this so it won't just randomly disappear. And I better fix the time. Time set. Let's do it. Time 0800. There we go. Brightens it up a little bit. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11. Grab one of those glowstone. Place it right there, right there. Okay. Now, let's place this here. That won't work. We'll do it with black, so let's go here. make this neat little shape. We'll select all of this.
And now we're going to do set sugar cane. Oops, my bad. Replace black sugar cane because we're racist like that. Let me get this pretty awesome little feature. I love this. Uh, I'd never thought in a million years. But unfortunately, you have to be careful because if you go boop, they're all gone. But luckily we can... Oh, well. I can do replace near two, so. Three. There we go. There we go. Got our cool little decoration back. Friggin' love it. Okay, let's clear all this out. Clean that. Grab a wand. Now, let's do an even cooler thing. Let's make an office space right over here. This is just something simple. I'm not trying too hard right here. Okay, there we go. Let's grab ourselves a stair. Make a chair here. Oops. There's our nice table. Let's see, where's a painting? Put a painting there. And come over here. Maybe give him a nice poster in his office. Because, hey, it's an office, you know. Gotta have some fun. In fact, it's actually too big of an office. There we go. Just slip on in here. And every office has to have some pretty cool lighting, right? So, let's grab ourselves some quartz slabs. Let's see. Put them right here. That's actually too low. Now this isn't a let's build or anything, so don't go judging me because I suck right now because I'm not really trying to make something amazingly super awesome, cool, new packs or elite or anything like that. Okay, now let's give this guy some lighting so we can have a light right here, have a light right here, have a light right here, another one right here. Actually, we could probably square it out a little bit like that that out. Okay. Now, this one's another neat trick. We grab these. Okay, let's see. What's the item ID for this? Item DB for item database 447. Okay, so now we can do replace 44. Do I have to do 447? If you had multiple slabs of different types, you would have to specify the 7 data value, but no worries about that. 44. And then flower pot, and I think it's eight. I'm not going to be, nope, six, nope, five. Oh, that ain't going to work at all. So now we'll just change it to flower pot. Let's go flower pot. I can't remember which one's the cactus one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It would be the last one. That would be my luck. But you get these awesome little lights that hang down. And they kind of look like they're glowing if you look up inside there. Let's see how it looks without the shaders. Yeah, not too good. See how they look in Seuss. Whoa, 
Too much bloom. Ow, that hurts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. In depth of field shaders, they look about the same. So let's go back to Rudo Plays. I love this shader. It's so colorful and pretty. And let's give this guy put zero and wool. There we go. There we go. I'm pretty sure I have ice melting turned off. I'll make sure. This is also, I'll give you a little tutorial on this too. In order for this to work, in order for now replace ice you know what let's just go ahead and place ice all here I botched that. Uh, give him a little entrance here. Okay, there we go. And uh, in order for the ice to actually stay here, uh, I can't talk and do two things at once. Okay, good enough. Uh, you have to actually set the region flag for it not to melt. Otherwise, this will turn to water and pour out everywhere. These will slowly d start disappearing. The actual blocks of ice won't. Or if you have multiple of these like that, I don't think they melt. They make a pretty interesting stair set, though. <laughs> but, I digress. Uh, so you have to either select the region, name it with like region define delphine define blah 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 and I got a text message hold on one second and uh, then you would take and be like region flag blah 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 ice dash melt deny and then the same thing with snow melt Otherwise, it'll just start disappearing, and that's a pain in the ass to deal with. And people will be like, oh man, all my ass is melted. What are you doing? Your server sucks, noob. You'll be like, oh man, shut up. Your server don't suck. God. And you'll lose friends, and then you'll move away, have to be an outcast, and no one will love you. Your parents will just practically drop you, and I'm being way too dramatic over this, but still. I drank one of those V8, two of those V8 Fusion Energy things, and oh my god, it make you so hyper. And, uh, delicious, too. Orange pineapple. Check it out. Uh, if V8, anyone's watching, you owe me about a hundred bucks for that. And, uh, even though you didn't tell me to do it, but I'm doing it anyway, so buy me. But, yeah, let's make a sofa. You can't have a friggin' TV like that, a big-ass TV like that, without a sofa. In fact, let's make that TV even bigger-ass. So, you're going to want that, want that. Where would my wand go? Set 78. You can also do this with different thicknesses, I forgot to mention. You can do 78. There's seven different data values for this. You got 78, 0, which is the same thing. And then you got set all the way up to 78, 7, which is a full block because it's 8 thick, 0 to 7 is 8. But you can change your thickness and make a pretty cool cabinet. Let's do three. Ay, let's clean this out. Get my wand back. There we go. And do 78, 2, and have a thicker TV cabinet. But personally, I think that looks like crap. So, I'm not going to do that. Got to have another button. 
yellow swag. Oh, please don't hate me. Please don't uh, subscribe for that. I was, I was just joking, I swear. Please don't. I love you. Anyway, go ahead and let's see. What kind of couch do we want? Hmm. Oh, God, I can't wait for carpets. It's going to be so cool. You can make like a half slab couch with a carpet on it to make it a different color. It's going to be so sweet. But you know what? Let's go ahead and make a pure white couch. So let's see, right here. It's going to be the same width as the TV. I think, there we go. Bring that out like that. And we're going to want snow. And little snow. Yeah. It's like the bars. It's right, right down there. It's like, eh. AT&T. Okay, so put those there. Let's put these here. Put that there. No. There we go. So now we're going to place that there. So we go. Select like that. I don't know why I did that. We'll expand it to one right. And then we'll replace 0, 78, or set 78, whatever you want to do. And grab that. And that. And set it to 0. So that we have that cool de design. And grab that. And that. Expand one up. And contract one up and then we'll set another 78 and then we'll set 78 again right there you know I don't like that let's do this expand it one left. We're going to set it 78. 5. Ah, there we go. And we're going to set that to 78. 7. And that one to 78. 7. And I done goofed right here. We're going to replace all that with 44, 7, then delete these. You got yourself a pretty sick looking couch. You can go all kinds of crazy with these designs. I mean, you're not limited to this. Uh, you know, use your imagination. <sighs> That's good soda. And, uh, I mean, you could do this right here. This is, this is a pretty cool design. We'll start here. Let's see here. I think this is how you do it. No. I'm trying to think of this design I saw earlier. It's, it was so cool. Uh, shoot. Now that I've done, now that I'm thinking about it, I can't remember it. But let's see. Replace zero seventy eight. I think it was two. And it actually broke off like earlier than this. And that to that. So seventy eight. Yeah, it was something like that. Oops. Redo. There we go. And set that one to 78. And you get this neat little designy thing. You can do it with any size you want. That looks pretty cool. You can take and expand this out. Oops. Sorry. You can do 
that. Contract one up. Contract one forward. Oops, you gotta be sanding that way. And still one right. We can set 78 that way. And you get this pretty neat little receptionist desk with a white chair. Hello, can I take your order, sir? Or, yeah, I guess you'd take an order at the receptionist desk, because that's how that works, right? But anyway, this video is getting pretty long in the tooth. It's like 15 minutes long or something. And I just wanted to show you these neat little tricks you could use to spruce up your builds if you have access to creative tools such as world edit and voxel sniper and I'll show you how to do one of these with voxel sniper it's not as easy to do because you can't do the underneath ones as easy I don't think but anyway we'll do a little 2x2 two two table here place that place that set your voxel to 78 set your brush to a snipe with material and no physics and then you'll need a gunpowder Remember, uh, the arrow takes away the gunpowder adds. You can do it like this. If this is your preferred method, be, uh, by all means do it. You can place that, place that, place that, place that. I don't know if you can do the TV. Let's find out. I'm curious if you can do the TV with it. Place that, that. You get another super long TV. Place that, place that, 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 and that. Oh yeah, you can. Yeah, you can definitely do that. Uh, so I guess you can do the exact same things. Can you mirror that table? Let's see. It's going to need one of these sticking out. And then two. That's a bug with Voxel Sniper sometimes. It will take and uh, like do a double thickness. You can prevent it by explicitly telling it that voxel is 78, voxel ink is zero, and then doing, I think, brush, snipe, material, material performer, like that. And you're guaranteed that it won't do a double thick one. But it's, it doesn't always work. But anyway, uh,. Yeah, let me clean my inventory. I'll do another tutorial sometime down the road, and that'll be full, and it'll get on my nerves, and I'll crap and complain. And so yeah, I hope you learned a little bit from this video. Uh, thanks for watching. I'm flying around here like a superhero, and don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and tell your friends about this video if they have any questions how to do this. And I'll see you later, guys. Thanks.